as he pimp smacked Mosquito. <laughs> There's no way that happened. Please show it. Please. <laughs> He's naked. We just speed blitzed it. That's clean. What am I watching? Top 10 One Punch Man moments. Now, just a little backstory before we hop into this. I watched maybe five episodes of One Punch Man way back, way back in the day. And I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna lie. I, I didn't even really like, like it that much. But I'm thinking about giving it another chance. Now, <laughs> I want to see this video, Top 10 One Punch Man moments, to see if the show is really like, I, it has a lot of hype. I'm, I'm just, just, just want to see a little bit into it. You know what I mean? And, um, yeah, maybe I'll pick up the show and react to it. So let me know if you guys would want to see that. And um, yeah, let's hop right into this video. Top 10 One Punch Man moments. Okay, we're starting off. This animation is very fluid already. I don't really know. I don't remember much about the plot of One Punch. I just know he one punches people. That's it. He's a hero. That reminds me of uh, Dragon Ball Super Superhero. One Punch Man Bro, this animation is actually entertaining and popular anime of recent times. That being said, I settled on a video highlighting the top moments in One Punch Man. These moments better that's be badass. Right, I wanted to make a compilation that's all about Bro, that animation. Beloved, albeit a tad bit lazy hero who sacrificed his hair for power. I do remember I that. I do remember totally that. Totally an original list video, but hey, bro, I just want to see some crazy battle. fights. That's so what I've been craving. And get ready for this list. That's what I've been craving. I, I, I... Saitama vs. Giant. Did I see that? Did I get this far? I don't know. Bro, the animation is crazy. Hold on. We start off the list highlighting the battle from the very first what? episode. What? That's, that's unique. The giant man. A regular dude called Marugori became the towering mutant menace giant man. Attack on Titan? Question mark? Oh no, I remember this. I, I saw this, yeah. That his scientist this might have been like the last episode I watched or something. These I don't remember. Two, though, mainly it was giant what episode was this? But, no, but I remember this. Caused a lot of damage to various cities. Mm -hmm. Finally, Saitama steps in and lives up to his name as he literally knocks giant man out. In one punch. Cause he's one point. Yeah. All right, I'm not gonna lie. Saitama is cool as fuck. I'm like, I'm not even gonna lie. To you. Pretty okay. That's kind of fire. I'm not, that was that was kind of clean. What are we... <laughs> Bro, the animation looks so good. Okay, bro, he's fighting in the PJs. Not straying too far from episode one. At number nine, we have Saitama's next opponents, the subterranean people. Subterranean? I think I saw this, this too. This next battle was a bit uh, I think. unusual. Bro, that, First, a that's fire! attacked Saitama while he was relaxing in his apartment, and when he tried to fend them off, his usual one-hit KO didn't work. Did it work? The assailant belongs to a large group of creatures called the subterraneans. <laughs> this animation is clean and they've come to seize the surface world for new real estate what studio does this i'm pretty sure map is doing season enough, three i don't know about the other ones king is a total unit but it turns out the dog that was looks just sick the entire epic encounter the fight was wonderfully animated it? and has some really great hand-to-hand -hand action yeah i'm looking at you spoiled unless i already seen this i can't remember it's been a long time Bro, that, this, this, the, like, the fight sequences are already look amazing, and we're, what is this, number nine? Bro! Yeah, yeah, this is the anime I need to watch if I want some cr crazy fights, I already can tell. I feel like I remember seeing this guy too, episode two, yeah, okay. Bro, some of the character designs are weird. I'm not even gonna lie. I think in the first episode there was some guy with like balls on his chin. One Punch Man and the King of Beasts. King of Beasts, Kaido. made our friends over at Peter Happy. I mean, they already accused Pokemon of endorsing animal abuse, so I'm actually surprised they didn't jump on this. Anyway, for this battle, Saitama went toe to paw with Beast King, an artificial mutant sent by Doctor Genus to capture One Punch Man so that he could use him as a human research subject. That clearly didn't work. How did go near as well as these poor, unsuspecting mooks thought it would? As usual, a single hit. Bro, this animation is so fire looking. From a disemboweling punch. Hello. This just looks so clean. What am I missing out on? How did I drop this show? Am I good? <sighs> 
Bro, this is episode two. What? Also, what the fuck? Moving on to number seven, Saitama saves Genos. In a superhero series, it's expected for the what titular hero to save the damsel in distress. Even though Genos isn't a damsel per se, he was definitely in distress. And by whom, you ask? Well, as it happens, he's in distress because of a damsel. That's if you okay, consider okay. someone like Mosquito Girl, who absorbs the Oh, blood yeah, I don't think I remember an episode like Saitama couldn't get the mosquito or he couldn't kill it or whatever. I think I saw that. The damsel. Especially considering Damn. the fact that she yeah, was a fine ass mosquito, let me tell you. With the cyborg in their fight, literally Sorry. cutting him down to size by taking a limb and slicing him open. But just because she laid down the coup de grace, Saitama went from one punch man to one slap man as he pimp smacked mosquito. <laughs> no into a way that happens. Please show it. Please. <laughs> <laughs> He's naked. Oh, what the? Bro, what? Cut. I'm watching this. What? What was that? Carnage Kabuto. Yo, is this music from the show? That's fire. Six, it's Saitama versus Carnage Kabuto. For this entry on the list, we finally come face to face with Dr. Genus. The insidious scientist has only one more trump card left to play. And the name of that trump card is Carnage Kabuto, Dr. Genusi's I, I think I ultimate mutation. Was this the last episode? Saitama well, I, can't, I, think I vaguely remember this, I think. Special chamber of Dr. Oh man, it's all gonna come back to me when I watch this. this same episode that we learned the secret if I do, let me know. Ooh, that shot is clean. Strong, which, that shot is really out, clean, what the hell? Training exercises taken to a maximum level. Um, this Carnage Kabuto to take let on me know in the comments if I should watch One Punch Man because this is getting me excited. With full I might do an opening reaction too. I, I know the first one I think. Like One Punch. I don't know how many there how many there are, but I'll watch them in a video. Into oblivion and then whale in his oh, by the way, I'm not really listening to what this guy is saying. Um, between a person and a store sale. In case he's saying spoilers. Okay, his voice actor too. Who voices him? That was fire. Animation clean again. Like hello. Over at number five, Saitama versus Genos. It, wait, is this where he like kicks him? I've seen this like clip like thirty billion times. At five, we have Saitama. Yeah, versus like that. Genos. I've seen that. That is this clean. Is about, Genos didn't hold back in any way. We see fluid, motion-focused animation. Bro, yeah. The scene. This type of animation, fluid animation. Style is hardly easy to do. So kudos to the artists and respects to their surely dead wrists for pulling off this frame-by-frame -frame feat. Anyway, the main point of this. Nah, that's, I'm is excited. To what the? Saitama's what episode was this? I'm not even gonna go back and look. I want to be surprised when I see it. Hero registry exam. This is However, fire. He wanted the bald hero to take it seriously. God, I've been sleeping on One Punch Man, bro. What am I doing? Something we've all come to. How can I call myself an anime fan? Point. I haven't seen this. This so looks amazing. That he wants his master I heard season two kind of falls off a bit, but I'm sure I'll enjoy it. What he wants. We're just speed blister. That's clean! What am I watching? Oh, he didn't hit him though. He didn't. Uh, I thought he was gonna hit him. Okay. Uh, that probably would have killed him actually. Time for lunch. I feel like Saitama is gonna be so funny. This. Bro, I can't get over this animation. Like. What is a meteor? Is that what that is? And bro just punches it. Number four, we have of course Saitama he does. Destroying the meteor. Okay, yeah. Prior to Saitama coming in to stop the, the meteor, animation is beautiful, bro. I'm gonna keep saying it. Heroes made their own attempts to destroy or even steer the meteor away, but they all failed. Genos made an attempt and seemed like he could pull it off, but he exhausted too much of his body's energy and blaster power that he went into an automatic shutdown. Enter Saitama, every bit the badass he is, as he goes up, up, and away to blast through the ball of rock and fire. The animation for this best Can Saitama be Goku? I don't even want to start that in my comments. Don't answer that. Shows how much attention the artist gave to this scene. <laughs> like, Again, let's pray for the I'm biased. Of these hardworking creators. Goku slams. I'm sorry. I'm biased. I'm biased. I'll admit it. Bro, that's fire. That is clean. Yo, not uh, monkeys. What even is that thing? 
deep sea king. At number three, it's the battle How do I keep getting DC impressed King. by the animation We've every about time? Saitama's battles and best moments for most of this Hello? List. So at number four, we're going to shift gears and focus on Genos and Moomin Rider. This time they face the Deep Sea King, a tyrannical this ruler. Even, wait, the it's not even focusing on Saitama? That is clean. People. Two things that make this fight worth. I feel like Genos is going to be like a goaded character. Genos holding his own even when the tides, no pun intended there, shift out of his favor, even risking his life to save a little girl from Ew. getting struck by the self-proclaimed king's acid spit. And two, the surprise appearance of C-class M hero Moomin Rider, Rider, who fought with yeah. Deep Sea King. Yeah, I, I heard this guy's like a meme. He was severely outclassed and kept getting back up even when he was put down. <laughs> Wait, it just bro, just the, the I guess he is a meme. Bro's not doing anything. Fight, but the size of what the even is this thing? The dog. Also, don't worry, One Punch Man arrives soon enough. Bro, does I have to save them every time? Combo. I'm not complaining because, you know, he's the main character. Right? Second to last top moment, we're focusing on the S rank heroes and their battle with an absurdly powerful enemy known as Melzagard. Again, we're changing focus from our titular character to others. In this case, the S rank heroes Silver Fang, Atomic Samurai, Metal Bat, Puri Puri Prisoner, and their enemy, the monstrous alien Melzagard, a member of the Dark Matter Thieves and one of the main antagonists of the Alien Conquerors arc. It's only when Metal Bat makes a surprising discovery of a marble in one of the separated parts of Melzagard that the heroes figure out how to defeat this monstrous alien. One by one, each of the S-rank heroes makes an awe-inspiring display of their respective skills as they crush each marble. This battle was hardly easy for the S-rank heroes, but nonetheless, they come out victorious and eventually manage to defeat him. <laughs> And finally, ladies and gentlemen, we've come to the moment we've all been waiting for. The most epic Hold moment. Four. Anyway, before I made a, a massive mistake, I was saying, this, what is this character design? What is the animation? First of all, this is fire. And, and what is that character the design? What's his, I think his name the was Boros? Moment within the One Punch Man series of like that character design is fire. This animation is clean. So far until season two. This moment Wait, this was before Saitama's season two? Lord so there's Boros, even more the cool moments? Nah, I gotta watch this. Much like Saitama, the intergalactic Bro, deals with what is this fight? crisis in which he lost all three in life after becoming so powerful. I need How to watch this. Remedy this. This is the last episode of season one. I need to get to this. Hello? Prophecy, of course, and eventually his search led him to meet One Punch Man. I could go on about what makes this battle number one on the list, but I'll His character design two alone makes points. me want to watch this. The first is that Lord Boros actually survived Saitama's fabled one hit KOs. And the second is Survives? that the longest that Saitama has ever had with any of his past enemies. Both combatants exchange blows and don't hold back whatsoever. Just when it seems like Lord Bro. Boros will win, as he uses his ultimate move, Collapsing looks... Star Roaring Cannon, our bold hero unleashes his own final attack, the Serious Punch. The Truly, Serious Saitama Punch? Is the strongest hero. He's such a magic series. Magic Okay. What is this? What is the music? What is the scale of this attack? So those are my favorite moments from the One Punch Man series. Or at least they are the best ones until season two comes along. And if you like my channel, then do subscribe. Go click subscribe. the notification bell. Check out my Twitter. And maybe even consider supporting the channel by donating to my Patreon. Don't do all that. Until next time. Amazing video. In prop replica arms. See ya. I am incredibly shocked and blown away at this. I didn't know One Punch Man had it like that. I'm, I was low-key a hater on One Punch Man because I didn't like it back when I first watched it. But I feel like if I gave it another chance, I might like it. Based on what I saw from this video, anyway. Let me know in the comments if you guys want me to react to One Punch Man. I 
I'm low-key excited for it, honestly. That this video really changed my perspective. But um Yeah. Just let me know in the comments, like the video, and I'll catch you guys next time. I'm excited. I wanna watch this, so please tell me to watch this. Um and yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.